hair because you don't have to use as much oil and um, you don't have the extra fat in your foods. Um, but you love the benefits of a pressure cooker because you're cooking fast and everything comes out perfect and juicy every time. You can do it with this one. We do have a feature price. Uh, we do have free shipping and we've got exclusive colors, either black or white. And we're gonna give you all the details on that and help you out in picking yours up. But we have a today's special, and I don't know if you've picked it up yet, but it is from Embassy. It is their most powerful shredder that they've ever done. And if you've been needing a shredder, especially now at tax time, we've got it for you, our today's special. just say that Embassy is really such a big name when it comes to shredders because they actually manufacture approximately a fourth of the world's shredders up to six million units a year. Every Embassy shredder here at HSN is a customer pick. You've got all beautiful colors, even that new color of that olive green. You have the ability to shred up to 120 sheets at a time, okay? So if you have a lot to shred, maybe you've got boxes and boxes that you've been holding on to, knowing you can't just throw them away. Guess what? Pop them in your embassy and it's no problem. Now, what's great about this is that it's already a customer pick. So if you wanna read the reviews, you're free to do that. But we've got it for you. I'll show you the colors and then we're gonna dive into all of the details because it's not like your old shredder from years ago. This is the micro cut. If you're ever gonna buy a shredder, you only want to buy a micro cut. Today, you just decide which color you want. We've got it for you in that navy blue. Next to that, you've got that brand new color, which is olive green. We also have it in red. And I like that they make the shredders in fun colors too, because they fit really into our lifestyle. We've got it also for you in white. We have black, and we even have this in gray, which just by itself is very different than what you see in the home, you know, in the um, office supply stores where they might have gray, okay? We've got them all. We've got them on six flex of $22.50. You've got free shipping. And let's dive in with the details. Bill yes. Duggan, who's joining us. We're excited because we only had one today special last year with Embassy. So this might be the one and only. Yeah. And what are you getting? You're getting one of our most powerful ones. Yes, you get fun colors. Yes, you get micro cut, which protects you the most. And yes, you get, you know, your typical shredder where you, you feed in 12 sheets in the front, but you have that auto dock feeder in the back. Notice it's shredding from two different sides. Wow. And the auto dock feeder can accommodate not just 19 pages, but up to 120 sheets. And it just keeps going going and going. And the cool thing about this is while this is shredding, I'm off doing other things. I'm making my cup of coffee. I'm continuing to find junk that I need to shred. And, and you know what? It feels good. Because normally for a lot of us, mm -hmm. shredding was always a chore where I had to like sit right on top of the machine, count out the number of pages, make sure it didn't jam. I want you to realize the power and the performance. You have a larger bin that we've ever given you before. We yeah. call that the peekaboo window. Yes. One of our viewers called it an instant gratification window. Because uh -huh. you can see it right before your eyes. Instead of pulling off the lid like other shredders, I'm gonna stop this just for a second. It's a pull-out drawer. So I take the drawer out to the trash, and what I'm throwing away is unidentifiable. This is what we mean by micro cut. Because this was strip shred from the 70s. Mm -hmm. This is how fine it is. And can you tell me which one's a medical record, which one's a tax no. document? You can't. No. Nor can you piece it together. And that's why you want a micro cut shredder. And I'm going to turn this one on. We remove the safety. So you can see what it looks like. Oh, it's raining. I love oh, it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and the thing is, remember, that's from the auto feeder. So I don't even have to stand over the unit and feed in all the junk mail, feed in all the applications. Like, mm -hmm. oh, junk mail, don't need that. Yeah. I'm on top of the shredding. So it doesn't right. get, become a chore. It doesn't get backed up. Mm -hmm. And that's a big deal, too. And that's one of the reasons why I like it in colors. Because if you, a lot of people put their shredder right where they open their mail. Right. So for you, whether that's the kitchen or the laundry room or the home office, wherever it is, pop your shredder right there so that you just shred it and you keep on going. Yep. And you don't have all of that sensitive information just laying around to either get lost or misplaced. Right. Or, or not shredded. Um, and it's, and it's, it's really necessary. A shredder is not a luxury. No, not anymore, because actually the identity theft, it's on the rise. We went to the Federal Trade Commission. One of their number one complaints annually is identity theft. And this is what they advise everyone. There's many steps a consumer can take to reduce the risk of being an identity theft victim. For example, guard your social security number. Mm -hmm. We always hear that, right? But then shred charge receipts, shred credit applications, and shred other sensitive documents. That other 
It's going to be different, not just for every household, yeah. but literally every individual. Yep. You know, someone's going through a medical procedure, they have a bunch of stuff. You're going through financial aid process, taxes, it, the list goes on and on. And some of that stuff we need to keep, and we do, yeah. but after keeping it for years, the, pack, the stack gets bigger and bigger and bigger. Right. And then we just can't throw it away because, you know, my paycheck sub has the same information from years prior to today, yeah. and that's why we need to be smart about it. That's Another right. thing everyone has to realize, because I hate to remind everyone, tax season <laughs> is I here. Know. Do you know 49, oh, I love this, 49% of all identity theft is during tax season. Wow. Right now. This be is the time. Yep. Yeah. And so, so this is allowing you to get ahead of that. Totally. And be preemptive, because you think about it this way, you know, the company is sending you your W-2, you're mm -hmm. sending it back to the accountant, you're mm -hmm. printing stuff off the computer and making mm -hmm. copies, mm -hmm. and then you're just throwing it away. Yeah. Don't do that. Take all that stuff. Take the stuff that comes in the mail. Mm -hmm. Take the stuff that's been, you know, overflowing that junk drawer, that home office, or yeah. that stack, and just start to shred it. It feels nice. great. Just realize nice. you're getting power and performance. Shreds in the front, shreds in the back. I can go through credit cards, reward cards. Mm -hmm. That has my identity oh, on that's it. that's so good. You know, this is going to come in a box. It's mm -hmm. going to be shipped to you. By the way, ships for free. Yeah. Weighs about 20-something pounds, so that's important. But this box with your identity or mailing label, look at this. The cardboard and the paper. And look at that. What happens on the other side? That's look, your identity. That is amazing. And what's really amazing too is we're excited about a piece of office equipment. Yeah. I mean, there's been times where you walk up to your printer or your computer and it's like, why isn't this working? Why right. isn't this working? Your embassy has one job. And all our MCs do one thing. Mm -hmm. They shred, and got to tell you, it, they do it well. They do it and well because... And that's why it's a huge customer pick. Ev every embassy um, currently is a mm -hmm. customer pick on hsn.com. And it's because, like you said, they've got one job, and that's what they do. Mm -hmm. And they do it. And so if you've been needing or wanting a, a shredder, maybe you have a shredder, but it's old. Right. Maybe you, you like me, have burned up several shredders <laughs> over your shredder lifetime. You're not alone. <laughs> um, yeah, it happens. You want one that's powerful. So, because you don't want to, this is not something you want to have to keep buying year after right. year. You want something that's powerful, and that's why the micro cut is important. I don't know what can be smaller than confetti. Glitter? I mean, I don't know. Right. But it, it gets to be about confetti size. Mm -hmm. So you've got the security that you're looking for, which is the reason you purchase a shredder. Now, right. which one do you get? The one that is known to be a customer pick, the one that is strong and powerful mm -hmm. and fast and easy to use, and has a six-gallon capacity bin, so you don't have to change, throw, you know, change the bin every time you shred ten sheets. You can keep going and going, and it's going to be able to hold all of that. Comes with wheels and on wheels, um, and the fact that we've got it as a today special for today only. I don't know if we're going to have another Embassy Shredder mm -hmm. in 2020. We're doing it in February. It's a long year if you don't have the right shredder. So I say get it now in gray, black, white, red, olive green, or in navy blue. Those are right. your choices. And remember, the, the olive green and the navy are exclusive. You won't find those anywhere else. And, Tammy, you brought up another great point. Um, there are a lot of choices out there. And, you know, you go to the big office store, and you're like, okay, well, I want a shredder, and you just go cheaper, cheaper, Cheap, yeah. and you start sacrificing. The biggest advancement is micro cut mm -hmm. the latest advancement is that auto feed mm -hmm. where in fact like right now we're shredding but we're, yeah. we're having a conversation right and mm -hmm. the cool part about this is like oh yeah i'm still cleaning out my desk oh found this don't need this yeah i can shred two things at the exact same that's time that's so good actually i came back from vacation yeah. and i was like oh god i have all this junk mail what am i going to do with all this stuff you know what mm -hmm. i did i just took the whole stack mm -hmm. and i literally just put it in the feeder and next <laughs> thing you know i did i went back to um oh it grabbed a lot right there listen but what that. happened I went on and unpacked the, the bags yeah, and started yeah. the laundry. Because that's just it. We have other things we need to do. Mm -hmm. We don't have time to sit over the shredder for hours, and, yeah. feeding through page mm -hmm. after page after page. Mm -hmm. So you're getting the auto feeder and you're getting micro cut. And you might have think about, I have a shredder, but mm -hmm. how old is that shredder? Is it a strip cut? And let me just show you and illustrate how this all works. Here is strip cut technology. Remember those, 30 shreds per page. Yeah. One little piece gives away your information, but then 30 piece puzzle, it's easily put together. Right. Cross cut was definitely another option. You can see the size difference of all the shreds. People have figured this out because it's been around long enough. And a lot of people are like, who goes to that effort? People who uh, want to shop with your credit, right. your identity. That's right. It's the, yes, this is their full-time job. Mm -hmm. I got a job. Mm -hmm. they, this is their job. Yeah. With microcut, it's almost identity-proof because it is so small and so fine. That's Realize right. this is one 
one page. You can get up to 12 pages, 120 sheets going in at a time. Yeah. And also because it's so small, it fills up the bin a lot less because yeah. at the end of the day, that bin can start to overflow and then it's like, oh, it's just, you know, you shred and you throw away, you shred and throw away. Yeah. With this, it's, it's minimal. And we've all done this too. Throw a piece away, right? Mm -hmm. It's not gonna happen to me. Well, let me tell you, when we launched the embassy brand here, and we were allowed to say one in 10 of us were victims of identity theft. Now, it's one in seven. Wow. It's actually on the rise. You think it would be, we'd get better with it. Yeah. But more of our information is just out there. It's on the printed page. Yeah. All 120 pages are gone. That job is done. Wow. And did I have to sit through that? No. Did I have, did I have to ignore phone calls and stop my no. shows? Nope. And the thing is, when I put this out at the curb, it is safe because it's that fine micro cut. Mm -hmm. And that's really what we want. Also, look at how much space this one page is taking up. Yeah. The one that I just crumpled up, like it's not gonna happen to me. Right. Fills up the bin that much faster, this does not. And you know, there are dumpster divers out there who are looking for information, mm -hmm. but there's also uh, windy nights and mm -hmm. you know, raccoons knock over the garbage. Yep. Now your tax information, your paycheck sub yes. prescription yeah. is in the neighbor's yard. If you don't need this stuff anymore, don't just throw it away. Be smart about it. Yeah. Take it to your shredder. And yes, you brought up this before. The color's fun because maybe you do leave it out and you use it mm -hmm. every day because, mm -hmm. oh, the junk mail, don't need this, don't need this. And instead of getting around to shredding, yeah. I just love to, you know, put this all in here. Let it shred, go through it, take care of it. And yeah. then it do, you don't get behind the eight ball. Well, you know, I, I like that you showed that crumpled up piece of paper because it, with all your information because... Let's say you have an old computer and on that hard drive you have all of your, you know, personal information. Mm -hmm. When you want to get rid of that computer, there's no way you just put it out on the curb with the hard drive and all the information just sitting there. That's essentially what you do when you don't shred those important documents. You're just putting them out for the first person to come along who wants it, mm -hmm. who is going to take the time because the thing is, this microcut is making it hard for them. Right. I don't want to make it easy. And the thing is, what's hard for us is we have all this stuff we need to get rid of. Yeah. So we were doing some spring cleaning backstage. We found all these old host cards oh with information gosh. and product information. And we're like, oh, we got our cupboards back. We got our desks back. But we can't just throw this stuff away. Yeah. So normally someone's like, okay, I got to count out six, eight pages, 12 oh pages, gosh. and then stand here. Yeah. No joke, there was, I think it's Matt Davis, one of his first jobs, he's a guest here at HSN, yeah. was hired by a law firm to sit in a conference room and shred. That's wow. all I had to do, because back in the day, they couldn't take a stack of no. 40, 50, 60, 120 sheets no. and just take that stack, load it up, and boom, walk away. And you know what the funny thing about, even though he was getting paid to do it, <laughs> Um, it was still in readable form because it wasn't in micro cuts. That's just it. It was dated. Oh and the thing gosh. is, right now, like right now, I'm in the zone. I'm cleaning yeah. out. It feels great. I got this up and running. But you know, I find more stuff because have you ever done that? It's like, ooh, oh, cleaned out that drawer. Yeah. Let's go on to the next drawer. Yeah. And then fine. Do I stop just because it's auto feeding? No. It allows me to use both sides of the this shredder. So good. Both giving me that nice, secure, very small micro cut technology. Right. I don't know if you saw earlier, but I was going through staples and credit cards yeah. and cardboard because it does have that power and performance. So you see right over here, boom, boom, boom. And you notice right here, I'm gonna shred my paycheck stubs. Okay. So realize, some things we do need to keep. Mm -hmm. But after a little while, we can get rid of stuff. Yes. We call it shredding therapy. People <laughs> find it cathartic because it it's it so does. nice to... Oh, to clear, clear it out, out. Right. It, it feels good sometimes mm -hmm. depending on what you're shredding right. uh, you're out with the old exactly. um, and that's why shredders are that's why i said they're not a luxury they really are a necessity and it's a it's really about having the right shredder the a powerful shredder because you don't want to have to buy one every year. Mm -hmm. You want a powerful one to begin with and that's where Embassy comes in. So, every, you know, you can look on hsn.com. All of the Embassy shredders are customer picks for a shredder. <laughs> and what do people say? It's fast. I like that it works well. I like that um, I can put multiple documents in there mm -hmm. and it just takes care of it. It gives me peace of mind. It's shred and I'm done. I don't like Bill was showing you. You don't have to d have a stack yeah. and, you know, develop a stack of something and just spend an afternoon. Created, yeah. You know, a project. Shredding. My just mom to shred. used to pay my nieces to shred. 
<laughs> but she didn't even, even she didn't have a micro cut at the time. So even that, even after all of that, it still wasn't as safe as it could possibly be. Right. And ultimately, if I'm gonna bring in something new, especially, you know, something like this, I want it to be the best that it can mm -hmm. be. 120 sheets at a time. You can shred in the front and the back. A six gallon bin. You talk about bringing in new things. I love this because some people are like, we get intimidated by new and all yeah. that stuff. There is no Wi-Fi on this. Oh, there is goodness. no password, no app. You just find that thing that you don't want anymore and yes. you just put it in and it's gone. Oh, Safely, so nice. powerfully, and it yeah. does what it needs to do. Great for the family, great for the home office, great for the office. Mm -hmm. I sent one out to my dad's company because I was out there and I was, you know, at the cop machine making copies. I'm like, oh, I have like seven extras, didn't need them, but couldn't just throw it away. So guess what? I turn around, there was a shredder right there. Yeah. In permanent marker written all over it, no more than three pages. <laughs> so I was like, oh. So I had to wait for the first three, wait for the next three. Oh my goodness. I sent them one of these. The staff there was so excited. They're like, auto, they'd never heard of auto <laughs> shit, auto shredding, which yeah. is great. Right. But more importantly, it is a time saver. Yeah. Because you know what? I can just load it up and walk away. Right. I can be shredding and I can be shredding more. That's convenience in terms of productivity. This is convenience in terms of protecting ourselves. And that's what because ultimately what we want. Most of us who are victims of identity theft do not realize it happened to us until it's already happened. Mm -hmm. Years down the road or months down the road, it's hard to prosecute. And that's where all of a sudden it's like you're trying to re put the pieces back together. It happened to me when I was a sophomore in college. Mm -hmm. I went to sign for my financial aid check and I was you know, moved in the apartment. And then they're like, you don't qualify this year. I'm like, I, I, I get disappointed to think about it because, yeah. I mean, it ruined my whole college career almost. Yeah. It was like, are you kidding me? Right. And we had to go through the process of identifying it yeah. and piecing it together, proving who I was. Right. And that was just me. Wow. It's one in seven of us. Kids wow. and seniors are more susceptible. Well, think about it. And you were a sophomore in college, yep. which I mean, I don't want to, I don't want to put words in your mouth, but you probably didn't have a whole huge um, savings account. I didn't. You didn't have a house that, or a mortgage and all of mm -hmm. that. You didn't have at the time as much to lose as now that you're working. You mm -hmm. have a, you know, if you have a family, if you have kids, you have a bigger bank account. You don't want to lose what's there. And that's just it, because a lot of us don't realize it happened to us until you know what? I'm going to go get that new car. Yep. I saw that commercial for 3% financing right. and you sit down and they come back and like, you don't qualify. Yeah. You're like, stop the music, <laughs> excuse me? And then you're paying 8%, 9% and that's where it starts to cost you. This is a preemptive, it's smart, it's really convenient because yes. you know what? We all have stuff in our house that you know we keep for a little while but then right. after a little while, we can get rid of it. That's right. Paycheck stubs, you keep them about a year. Right. We, on average, taxes, you keep them for about seven years. But when I get this home, like what should I shred immediately? Well, pretty much anything with your information on it. Okay. I mean, that, that could be receipts even with mm -hmm. your credit card information on mm -hmm. it. A little bit of information goes a long way yeah. in the wrong hands. That's you call right. the 1-800 number, I'm Mr. Hooks, what are you talking about, blah, blah, blah. I oh. know I want to increase this, change that. Yeah. They don't know. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's what you shred immediately as soon as you get this home. But then uh, what about up to a year? Up to, well, your paycheck stuff you definitely want to keep because yeah. that's important. You want to make sure you get your vacation time, bank statements, make sure it all balances out. Mm -hmm. And that's that's just it. You don't have to keep everything forever. And after a year, <laughs> that's getting space back in your office. Yeah. Space back on your desk. And then about seven years is for your taxes and everything. But more importantly, we want you to be protected and yeah. you have peace of mind. Because mm -hmm. yes, it's getting rid of the clutter, but when I go up and shred this stuff, you'll be you'll be addicted. You will. Because it's kind of fun. And, and because it, it works, it works fast. Um, you could find this out in retail, you'd be paying $90 more than you yep. are today. Even our regular HSN price is about $65 more. Plus, you don't normally get free shipping. That's right. a savings of another $18 because you don't have to pay for shipping. So go for it. Gray, it. black, white, red, gr olive green, green, or navy, navy. blue. Yep. Bill, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Can we shred this one? Sure, done. That's my done. Okay. All Next. right. We're gonna. I'm gonna head on over to the kitchen. Thanks. Adele. I hope you didn't need that. <laughs> no, because it's gone forever. Uh, we're gonna head on over to the kitchen. We've got the Ninja Foodie. We've got the Spoon Buddy, and so much more. Hang out with me. Thanks, Bill. Oh, thank you. Okay. Flex Pay is a way to pay off your purchase in small increments. I get to make monthly payments on it, but I have the item at home with me. That's probably my number one reason for shopping at HSN. To break it up and have a monthly payment that's usually so low, it gives you lots of opportunities to really make purchases that you might not be able to make otherwise. It just makes it accessible for everyone. Much better than throwing it on a credit card at a brick and mortar store. Shopping is easier than ever with the HSN app. 
Turn on notifications to get shipping updates, exclusive offers, and alerts on your favorite products sent straight to your phone. Now you can share all your fabulous finds with your friends right from the app through Facebook, text, and more. Save your favorite products all in one place. See it, heart it, save it. Download the app for Apple or Android devices by searching HSN app on hsn.com. Well, you're watching HSN, and I am glad you're here. We're going to be in the kitchen for the rest of this hour. I'm Tamara Hooks. I'm your host, but I want you to meet Derek Monk. Derek, we're glad to have you. Oh, nice. Good to see you. Um, Derek was on a little bit earlier with a product that I know you're going to love. Give us just a couple minutes because it's called the Spoon Buddy, and you're actually getting two of them. You choose if you want two blue, two black, or two red. Uh, they're $19.95 for two. You get free shipping, and you get three flex. But this is that... Why didn't I think of yeah. this product? And because, talk us talk us through what yeah. we've got here. Yeah, so what the Spoon Buddy is, it's a spoon rest with a suction cup. So you can suction it right on top of your lid, countertop or table, and after you're done with the messy utensil, you just place it right there. But when I had the idea, it was Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. we had mashed potatoes, the gravy, the green beans. What everyone was doing is after they were serving out of their pots, ooh, nice and hot pot, yeah. they, were, they were making a mess on their countertop or having the utensil yeah. fall in and get hot sitting in there. Right. So I thought, how nice would it be if you can just keep your utensil with the food that you're serving? It's brilliant. Brilliant. Right? Brilliant. So you have one for each different food food that you're serving, yeah. and there's no more mess in your countertops. I love that because it, one of the things that gets to, on my nerves is when somebody uses the potato spoon yeah. to dip into the exactly. vegetable spoon, and exactly. it's like that's not what it was supposed to do. So that's why you're getting two of them. Yep. I think, and they can go onto any lid. Any lid. You got your metal lids, your glass lids. I mean, this is even this is another feature right here too. This is just a plate, a regular plate, and you can use this plate to cover your frying pans there. Oh, that's so that I mean, that's a that's a really really strong strong, you know, yeah. suction there. So that it can, it can fit on anything, granite, glass, you know, any of your major major kitchen surfaces. This is so good. Yeah. And then you actually, it's got a specific size to it, so I yeah. can use it even for other purposes. Yeah, I mean, look over here. You got you got your, your regular spoon, mm -hmm. you got spatulas, tongs, I mean, obviously all the different types of spoons that we have here. Mm -hmm. So it can fit all different types of utensils. But um, not only that, uh, Tamara, you can also flip it over. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna grip and you're gonna help open your jars okay. too. You Seal pad jars. You hear that? You hear yes. that? Right? You know that can always be a pain, right? So right. you open your jar, then you take the jar, you go ahead, put it into your, put it into your, um, you know, meatballs that you got in the crock pot or anything like that. Yeah. Go ahead, serve it up with your spoon. You got a real messy spoon now. Just put it right on the spoon, buddy, just like that. So oh next time you're taking your crock pot over to your friend's house. Yeah. They're gonna, they're gonna be so impressed. Bring this Everything's right there, right? And notice, with all of the food that we've got yeah. out, we don't have any messy counters no. because the spoons stay up. And they're it, so much better than yeah. your regular like porcelain, you know, spoon rest or yeah. anything like that. Right. I mean, imagine if you had five spoon rests. Yeah. And try to try to put it on your countertop. I mean, yeah. it, it would be a total mess. So this is so everything's good. nice and organized. And remember, and you can throw this in the dishwasher when it's time to clean them. Mm -hmm. They're so simple to use. Yep. They are remind me half a cup in yeah. measurement. Yeah. So this is another really cool feature. So. Not only they're gonna hold your condiments too, we'll get to that, but this is exactly one half a cup. So this is a half a cup I have here. I'm pouring it in, it's gonna go all the way to the rim. So instead of you know digging through your drawers mm -hmm. and trying to find that perfect you know half a cup, yeah. you can just use the spoon buddy. It's gonna be out in your countertops, it's super easy to access. This is so good. So nice. And then like I said, you got your dips here. Let's say you want a veggie platter that you wanna take over. You got a party or something like that. Yeah. You can put your serving spoon right in the veggie veggie platter. Everything's nice and organized. It holds a half a cup of your of your ranch. Mm -hmm. Like I said, you want to get back to that opening. I job love thing? the so. open. So it keeps your countertops yeah. clean. It mm -hmm. keeps your spoons where they're supposed to be. Yep. You can serve with it. You can open jars. Yep. You've got a perfect half a cup measurement yep. in there. You're getting two of them. Two of them. They're free just shipping. under twenty dollars. They're free shipping. <laughs> if you want to get them on three flex, you can do that. And it and it's six dollars and sixty five cents to get these home and today is the first day you've seen these on hsn so it's really exciting when we can bring you those really simple easy oh this is exactly what i've been looking for kind of products which is exactly what this is yep. And I like that this was developed, as all great things are, out of a need. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. It was developed out of a need. You know, I was trying to help my family out, trying to help the grandparents, you know, cleaning up after they're cooking, everything like that. Yeah. You know, and everyone loves cooking, but everyone hates the cleanup. Yes, so if you can true. if you can eliminate that or at least reduce it in some way, yeah. it's going to be, you know, it's going to make you happier in the kitchen. It's so good. And remember, so we've got this one. It's just suction. So I just push yeah. it down. Yeah. So yeah. what you're going to do is you're going to push it down. Mm -hmm. So let's say, let's look at this one. This one's on a nice metal, metal lid here. Okay. I mean, look how strong this thing yeah. is. 
I know, I know. Yeah, you saw that? <laughs> yeah. But, you know, just because it's on there like that, there's actually a little push tab. Okay. So that push tab, you're going to be able to push that, and it's going to come and up nice it. and easy. Nice. So it's a very strong suction, like it, any of your glass, granite, yeah. smooth surfaces is going to yeah. work real well on. You, know, you got to make sure the suction cup's clean, the surface is clean, but it works real well on most of your kitchen surfaces. And so. just to show you the strength of it too, yeah. because that's the lid to a crock pot, yeah. which uh, we, most of us know, have, yeah. usually have a little bit of weight to them. Oh, yeah. So it's nice that you have, you can have your spoon buddy right where you need it. Yep. You never lose the spoon. Yep. You never drop the spoon or it doesn't get mixed in with other things yep. because you don't want your safe to get mixed in with your, your sweet. Nope, nope. <laughs> that's not good for anybody. Um, so you just, if you're getting two, if you need more than two, or maybe you're thinking about this for yourself, but also you want it to share it with somebody in your life who you yeah. know also cooks. And also we kind of complain about the same things. Oh, yeah. So it's nice if you want to get a set for yourself and a set for somebody else in your life. You're getting two blue or two red or two black, whichever is gonna be right for you. Let's open another one of these jars here. So this, this is a bigger jar here. Yeah, but a bigger boom, lid. Just like that. I mean, it's gonna add that grip there to help open it for you. And then you're gonna be able to pour your salsa right in your chips, just like that. Yeah. Put a little serving spoon in there. Boom, good I to go. I love so a multitasker. Uses, right? I know. Yeah. I love, so now we don't have to have a separate spoon rest, nope. a separate jar opener, nope. a separate, you know, bowl for our dips, and a separate, you know, measuring cup for in one spoon, buddy. Yep. Derek, I know what. Yeah, sure. cool. Thank no, you so no much. Thank you, Tamara. Keep shopping. Um, I know this was just a quick presentation, but go for it, okay? Red, blue, or black. Made in the USA. Definitely. Made in the USA. Sure. That's true. Yep. We need a white one in there. Red, red white? white, and that blue, would be nice. and yeah. black. <laughs> <laughs> All right, stay with us. We do have more coming up. I promised you at the top of the hour that we were going to have the uh, Ninja Foodie, the extra large, the eight quart, eight in one pressure cooker. It's a pressure cooker and an air fry fryer all at the same time. And it does so much more than that. It roasts, it broils, you could even bake in there. We're gonna give you all the details on that. But this is the bigger one. We did have one that was six quarts. This is the eight quart. So if you do need to cook more food at, the, at, at a time or cook for more people at a time, then this is gonna be the one that you wanna go for. We've got two exclusive colors, black or white. And we've, and we've got those coming up in about 12 minutes, all right? Francis Biondi is joining us. Hi, Francis. How are you? Good. You're about to make our lives in the kitchen easier yes. because Francis has brought along the KitchenAid five cup food chopper uh, with the blade and the whisk. And as we know, it's the prep Yes. that takes the longest in the kitchen. It is, that yeah. really takes so much time to be able to like, source your own ingredients, but not only that, but get your recipe down, now you have to prep, you have to chop, you have to, you have to uh, slice, you have to do all these extra steps, mm -hmm. but you can do it all in one in the five cup choo, uh, food chopper. Okay. Uh, so the five cup capacity is amazing, it's the perfect size for, for anybody, and it could tackle pretty much any job you throw at it. Okay. Uh, right now I have some Parmesan cheese, and the thing about Parmesan cheese store-bought, we don't know what's in there. It's, it's not just cheese, there's <laughs> preservatives, there's, yeah. there's there's cellulose in there too. Yeah. We don't want that extra stuff. We just want fresh cheese. So okay. here we are. So in that food uh, food processor, I'm just putting in the fresh Parmesan cheese. I have my multi-purpose blade in there too. I just lock it in place. And with just the touch mm. of the handle, it's so easy to use. I have this on the chop setting. And there we are. We have freshly chopped grated Parmesan cheese. Wow. And that was hard Parmesan cheese yes. too. I just broke it up in, in bricks just to okay. make it a little easier for now. I have it on puree here. If I don't want it, uh, as, as strong of a grape. Let's, let's go a little smaller on that. Now I have the puree setting. And you know, it's making a little noise, but for most yeah. food processors, yeah. this is actually quite quiet. Absolutely. Now let's check out this product here. Okay. So I'm gonna take out this multi-purpose blade. You can see there's two tiers on that blade. So it allows for that, the ease of use. So everything that gets chopped and goes down that down that chute, it chops it all up for you. Okay. So I'm just gonna twist this off and check out what we have here, just with that wow. Parmesan cheese. Look at how that's we a took perfect that block cream. of cheese and made a perfect uh, Parmesan with it. That is. Isn't that cool? And okay, so when you, a lot of times when we think of grating, we do think of cheese. But yes. remember, this is going to be for pretty much anything that you need to cut or to chop yes. in the kitchen. Exactly, exactly. It takes all your prep down to minutes. I mean, don't worry about all that stuff. Now, whipped cream. Yeah. Now, I have a KitchenAid food, pro uh, food processor, but I also have the KitchenAid stand mixer, and I love that thing. And we all know and love that. It has its quality. We've made that for over 100 years now. Uh -huh. Now, that same quality you're going to get in this uh, KitchenAid five-cup food chopper. Now, I'm making whipped cream. Now, instead of taking out that whole machine and mm -hmm. making whipped cream, yeah. the five-cup capacity 
actually is perfect for any of your desserts. So I just oh. put fresh whipped cream in here. Mm -hmm. As you can see, I started whipping it up and just with a touch of that handle, I'm bringing all that whipped cream together. You can kind of hear it change speeds, hear yeah. the sound, and now it has all come together. That whipped cream, freshly made, and now Ooh. not only whipped cream, but how about some flavored whipped cream? How okay. about a chocolate, quick chocolate mousse, right? Okay. I love chocolate mousse. It's a great dessert just to have quick, easy dessert if you yeah. don't have anything in your fridge already. I'm just gonna add a couple, maybe two or three tablespoons of chocolate uh, oh syrup to that. And I'm gonna close this in again. So how to use this, we just have that bowl, we lock it in place, right. turn it to the left, and I have my lid, and that lid has that little clicking system as well, and that's when you know it's set to go. Okay. I'm just gonna put my thumb right on top of here, and in instance, see that chocolate start to just incorporate instantly with that whipping blade. Now this is something you don't get with most other food processors. No. I don't know a food processor that has a whipping blade like this. I wouldn't have even thought of that. What, what else did you put in out. to make the whipped cream? Just whipped cream itself. So think about that. If you're gonna buy whipped cream yeah. in your store, there's extra things on that on the back of that. The ingredient list is like this long, mm -hmm. right? We just want that one thing. We just want that whipped cream. Now I'm just taking it out okay. to show you, look at that, look oh how that whipped cream gosh. has just come together. I'm just gonna add a little bit of that to our whipped cream that we already made. That is a perfect Now you made mousse. a really quick mousse. It's light, it's airy. Look at it standing up there. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? And you did it in the same chopper that you chopped, grated your cheese yes. in the same chopper that you're gonna do oh. your vegetables and everything else. All that stuff, yes, exactly. Now, I mean, I have to taste a little bit of this. Do you wanna taste okay. a little bit of this with oh, me absolutely. too? Here we go. Now, it. it's so light and airy. Check out the quality that you get on that food uh, chopper. Mm -hmm. Amazing, mm. and that's fresh. That's so good. That's, it's, it's so good, I'm glad you like it. Absolutely, I just wanna let you know, you're gonna choose your color on your KitchenAid. So you can choose it in white, we've got red, there's also black, and we also have it for you in silver. Um, and if you, um, if you have a KitchenAid, you know, other appliances at home, it would be nice if you can have a matching set or a matching piece that goes right along with it. But even if this is the first KitchenAid appliance that you bring in, there is a reason why this is a name that is known and trusted with the home cooks and the professional chefs alike. That's right. Uh, before I get into my next demo, I just wanted to show you what it's gonna look like when you take it out of the box. So you have your five cup food chopper. It's easy to clean, easy to store, easy to use. Now, easy to store. If you look into this uh, food cup chopper, you're gonna have both blades, your whipping blade stacked on top of your uh, multi-purpose uh, blade. It, it, no more, no longer do you have to look for blades, look for your attachments in your drawers. It all mm -hmm. stores together. It is BPA free okay. uh, bowl. It is dishwasher safe as well, so it's mm -hmm. easy cleanup. Mm -hmm. And as I said, easy to use. All you're doing is opening this and just shutting it and just with a touch of the handle, you have it ready to go. Mm -hmm. Now on top of this too, we have this great window. Um, you're gonna be able to look right into there and see all your ingredients coming together. And here we are. This is what's awesome about this food cup chopper, that drizzle basin. Mm -hmm. Now imagine making your vinaigrette making your pesto sauces, which we're about to make now, and you're drizzling uh, oil in, or you might have to open it up, pour it in, bring it back, and it's hard to, to let the process keep going. It right. needs to emulsify. Right. Um, so all I'm gonna do here is I have all my ingredients for my walnut pesto. Okay. I have my fresh basil, fresh garlic, walnuts, a little bit of oil to get it started. I'm locking this into place again. As you heard that click, it's ready to go. I have it on chop. And as you can see, that speed is allowing everything to get processed. Now it's starting to slow up in there. I need to add a little bit more oil. Okay. Now I'm gonna keep this going and into the drizzle basin goes the oil. And you can watch that oil gets stopped up to the top yeah. and it starts drizzling through that hole to process all of our pesto together. Oh, so yeah. in just a few minutes, instead of sitting there over a mortar and pestle, mm -hmm. constantly pounding and pulverizing your garlic, your paste that you have to make with the garlic and salts, uh, fresh basil, pinolis, like everything is all done now. Check this out. Look at that. And it your smells ed so good. You can determine the consistency you want. If you exactly. want it thicker or, or a little bit finer, it's all up to you and it's fresh. You're doing this at home right as you're serving it. So good. And, and it's, it's that five cup capacity, which is perfect for, I've made up to two pounds of pasta worth of pesto in yeah. this one five cup capacity. Right. And now, you know what, why not, let's take a little bit more of that Parmesan cheese well, in. of course, oh! A little corn bay on that cheese actually. Bay. Uh, done. And that's all, <laughs> <laughs> I like that cheese bay. And that's all done in your one five cup food, uh, food chopper. So if you're looking at this and you're wanting it, but maybe you were thinking, well, it's a little small, I want it something bigger. Just know you can do most of the things that we need to do yes. in the kitchen in yes. this size. Um, it is five cups. 
easy to use, easy to clean. Um, we've got it at a feature price and on three flex and go for it. You're yes. going to choose yours. I know we've got about three minutes. Let's okay. see what we can do. Let's do it. Minutes. So cauliflower rice. Uh, we're going to, we're sticking oh, with yeah. that new year's resolution. <laughs> yeah. Fresh cauliflower hits the puree setting. Boom. In just seconds, we have just made perfect cauliflower rice. Wait, that's all I have to do to make cauliflower? Do you and know that's how all much you they do. charge extra at right? the store? Exactly. For, for exactly. them to make it for you. Right, and you can do it all in a food processor. Oh my gosh. Why not the food cup chopper? And check out the uniformity of all those chops and, yeah. uh, and dices that you get uh, throughout. The carrots, the celery, the onions, okay. making your mirepoix, your bolognese. Mm -hmm. How about chicken salad? Mm -hmm. Two fully cooked chicken breasts are in here. Mm -hmm. Celery, mayonnaise, any other ingredients you want to add? Whoa. Totally fine. Again, okay. lock it in. Mm -hmm. Let's get it on the chop setting. And here we go. Now, as we're talking here about it, this is awesome. Just this chicken is nicely chopped in here. Mm -hmm. um, if that mayonnaise starts to let some of the ingredients stick, okay. I'm just going to push it down in there because sometimes that mayonnaise likes to bring things together a little yeah. bit more than we want. Yeah. Let's get it to that puree setting. Okay. And now let's really get it going. And there you are. You have chicken salad all ready to go. Oh my Put it on your toasted croissants, your brioche, whatever you'd like. And you have all your ingredients. Think of making lunch for the kids yeah. in a jiffy. I mean, no more store-bought stuff. No more having to go to 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 a, to a fast food place to just get your sandwiches done. Kids have lunch. You have quick and easy. It's healthy. You know, the funny things. I wouldn't have thought of doing chicken salad in there. And right. I know some of you are probably thinking, "Gosh, that you know, do I need to be an expert in the kitchen to use this to really no. get the use out of no. this?" You need to have ingredients, yeah. and you need to just be able to push down on a button, and you have it ready to go. Okay. Um, quick and easy dessert here or even a breakfast item. I have some frozen blueberries that I'm adding to this five cup chopper. Mm -hmm. I have a little bit of low fat milk as well. And all I'm doing is making like a really quick blueberry sorbet. I'm just gonna bring it all together. And all we're gonna do is lock it in place mm -hmm. and start bringing it Bring it there, there we go. Okay. And as it all comes together, we're gonna get that type of sorbet style um, uh, consistency that we want. Yeah. And I'm just gonna add a little bit more milk into this drizzle basin to okay. really incorporate it together. Oh wow, this is and so And there we fast. are. And that's what's so cool about that. The drizzle basin allows you to still puree, still do your chopping while you're getting everything together. Oh, and it's so cool. That? It's just a blueberry sorbet coming together. Beautiful. Yeah, and I love that five cup uh, capacity. It's just really the right amount that you need for your family. And remember, you're getting the, um, the chopping blade. You're getting the whisk. You get everything that you need in order to be able to use this breakfast, lunch, dinner, yes, dessert, exactly. snacks, mm -hmm. whatever whatever the case is. Um, close to uh, 2,000 of these have been ordered and you How just have to decide which one you want to get. Do you want it in silver mm -hmm. or white? We've got red or black as well. Yeah. And we even have a matte black, which is really nice too. Um, oh, what do we have here? So we're going to do a quick little healthy hummus. Okay. We could do chickpea, your typical hummus, um, but we're doing an edamame hummus. Okay. Just has a little bit more substance than just your regular peas. So we have peas, edamame hummus, yeah. um, a little bit of oil in there, and there we go. Into that puree setting for a little bit more power, and it's just bringing everything together, again, using that drizzle basin. I mean, look how easy it is to make your dips, your sauces for your everyday, maybe yeah. maybe your parties for your uh, sports yeah. uh, gatherings that you're gonna have with the guys. I mean, you can really do it all in this. Did you come up with this on your own, or is this something that you saw? So you can get any uh, any of these recipes or more recipes on Francis Biondi Official on Facebook, and okay. be able to check it out and keep up to date with me. I'm gonna have a lot of recipes on there for all of our KitchenAid products. Perfect, I love that. Go ahead and pick yours up, okay? We've got it at a feature price. We've got it on FlexPay. And pick yours up. I would love to send it out to you. We're going to check in with Andrew Lessman, and we've got the Ninja coming up. Thank you. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing, because information is the key to being a healthy person. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900.
you're watching HSN. We are in the kitchen and we're gonna make, if you're the one who does the cooking for yourself and for your family, we're gonna make it faster. Yes. We're gonna make it juicier. Mm -hmm. We're gonna make it easier. And we're gonna do it with the help of Ninja. Now, Rochelle Lucas is joining us. She's gonna be with us for the rest of the hour. And Rochelle has brought along the Ninja Foodie. This is the extra large. This is the eight quart size. It's an eight in one. What you're gonna love is that mm -hmm. it's a pressure cooker, which means you're cooking faster. And it's an air fryer for when you want that air fried, not deep fried, deep fried taste, but not the deep fried oil and fat. You get it all wrapped up in this Ninja. And you've got exclusive colors, either black or white. You get everything that you need, including the eight quart pressure cooking pot. You get the five quart um, cook and crisp air fryer basket. You're gonna get the pressure cooking lid, the crisping air fryer lid. You're also gonna get the exclusive dual-layered deluxe reversible rack, and you get a recipe book with 45 recipes that come right along with, and those are the ones you're gonna see here. If you need more recipes, I've got 175 more for you if you want this book. You're gonna want all the recipes, because once you get it home, it's gonna be your favorite like kitchen companion. <laughs> that's right, that's right, because it's just fast. It's fast, and so this is a perfect example of what the Ninja Foodie does best. It's a pressure cooker and an air crisper, all in one. So you could pressure cook your chicken and that's fine, but usually you'd have to move it to your oven to get that nice crispy brown skin that's golden and delicious. And so this is an example of, of that. So we have a, a pressure cooked chicken here, which is fine for if you're doing soups or if you're, you know, you're doing it for to make tacos or something, but this is what you want to serve your family. This is what you want to put on the dinner table. And because it's an XL, because this is a, the eight quart capacity, you can do a seven pound chicken in less than an hour's time. And so when it's just me and my husband at home, we just do a five pound chicken in about 30 minutes, but you have that extra capacity for when you need it. Can I tell you something? Mm -hmm. I thought that was raw. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, it's, it's so not what you want to eat. I actually thought it was no. raw. <laughs> it is cooked, it's pressure cooked, but this is that air crisp technology here yeah. that you have that nice, uh, you know, golden, tender, uh, you know, tender meat, golden, delicious on the outside. And I think we're gonna show you a little bit here in an animation of how that works um, okay. with the Ninja. So this is the Ninja Foodie. We're gonna start with the pressure cooking lid. So you're gonna put the pressure cooking lid on top this is going to cook your food in 70% less time. It's going to infuse it with flavor. It's going to make it tender, delicious, and juicy. And it's just going to be super moist meat, whatever meat you put in there. Then we swap the top. So you can see we're swapping the top for the air crisping lid. Now we're going to surround it with 365 degrees of hot air, which is going to make it really crispy, really delicious. Um, you're going to get that nice golden brown uh, skin in your chicken. We've got some ribs coming up. You're going to love how those come out. Um, but you don't have to transfer it to another pot. So I love it because it's one pot hot cooking. Okay. You don't have to put the ch uh, chicken in the oven. You mm -hmm. don't have to move your ribs to the oven. It's all done in one pot. And right. it's the, the pot is dishwasher safe too, so yeah. it's easy cleanup. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, so um, so how do I, you know, what do I do when I get it home? Sure, sure. So it does come with a recipe book. There's 45 recipes in the recipe book. Everything we're doing today is included in this one. And then once you get through that one, you might want the bigger book too, because it is going to be your best friend. So I just did um, the seven pound chicken. Now I'm going to show you just dinner for two. If you're wanting to do a quick, easy, easy weeknight dinner. You know, usually we go to the uh, our freezer when we're wanting something that's, you know, quick and easy and it's usually pizza or something that's not good for you. Now you can do frozen salmon, you can do frozen um, chicken, you can do frozen uh, beef and steaks and you do your pressure cooked the rice at the bottom and then you're just gonna do your salmon or your meat for two minutes. That's all it takes to pressure cook the salmon and then you add the vegetables with the air crisp. So this whole dinner took 10 minutes to make and you've got something healthy on the table. You could do you know dinner for two or four we've got our rice wow. already done Look in the same that. pot wow and it's really easy so yes you do have the capacity for entertaining but you also have a quick and easy way to make dinner I'm about to lose my spoon there it goes <laughs> I caught it um, you can do a quick and easy dinner in about 10 minutes on the weekday so you can you know if you're still trying to keep with your new, new year's resolutions yeah. in February God bless you I've already wrecked mine with the ribs we got coming <laughs> up but you can do something that's quick and easy um, a 360 meal. We like to call yes. it a 360 meal because it fits all three parts of your plate. That's Oops. for sure. And remember, you're getting that rack included, which is exclusive. That this also means because you can do your entire meal in one, that means you're not cleaning up a, a, a full kitchen full exactly. of dishes and pots and pans. It's easy cleanup. And you're serving yourself and your family uh, really quality food 
flavorful food that was so easy to cook. And it looks like you spent a lot of time and effort when really Ninja, the foodie, did all of the work. It does all of the work for you. And it's such easy cleanup too. The eight quart pot is dishwasher safe. The rack is dishwasher safe. Even the air fry basket is dishwasher safe. So usually after I uh, make dinner for my husband and I when I'm home, I'll just, you know, kind of put it in some soapy water, yeah. let it soak while we're uh, eating dinner. And then it's, it's pretty much done. It doesn't even need the dishwasher. It's good. Um, it's really fast and easy. So there are, we've, we've talked about pressure cooking, we've talked about air frying, but there's really eight functions that are included in the foodie, and one of them is dehydrate. So you're getting this double rack with your Ninja Foodie, and this is great for dehydrating because you can layer things in here. You can do your fruits, you can do your own beef jerky. Beef jerky is so expensive, so if you want to try it um, at home on your own, you can save some money that way. But it also bakes, it also broils, it also steams. There's actually eight different functions on here. Um, I would love to walk you through it and show it to you. Okay. So you've got all your tender crisp functions here. And Ninja is really smart. There's really good technology here because depending on which lid you're using, here, I'll just turn this on real quick so you can see. I've got the uh, air crisping lid, so the air crisping functions are the ones that lit up. If I use the pressure cooking lid, the pressure cooking functions are what light oh, up. So you've smart. got pressure, steam, slow cook, dehydrate. I'm reading this uh, upside down here, air, air crisp, um, bake and broil, and then also your dehydrate here. And then you also have a keep warm button. So if you're doing something for like a crowd, if you're doing a casserole yeah. and you're done cooking it and you want to keep it warm, you can do that too. So That's this simple. is a casserole that we did. So okay. we did two pounds of pasta. Um, again, if you're just you know doing dinner for two at home, you don't have to do two pounds, but you can when you need to. So we put dry, hard pasta in here. Didn't have to boil water. Okay. We added the sauce and we pressure cooked it, I think for five minutes, let me double check the recipe. Okay. We pressure cooked it for six minutes. Now I'm going to add the cheese and the pepperoni and turn this into a casserole oh. with the air crisping lid. So all done in one pot. Again, I didn't have to get a separate pot for boiling the pasta. I didn't have to get a separate pot for making the sauce. I didn't have to transfer it to a baking dish. I'm doing it all in one. And so I'm actually gonna set this to cook now. Okay. And towards like maybe in like five minutes, we'll come and check on it and you'll see what it looks like when it's done. Okay. I, I like that you're doing, you can do the multiple functions again, all in the same because this is an all in one. Mm -hmm. And if you've been wanting an air fryer and you've been wanting a pressure cooker and you're saying, but I don't have all the space in the world. I really do need to, you know, determine which one is going to fit mm -hmm. best in my kitchen. Now you've got it all. So now you don't have two appliances. You've got one that can do it all. You've got it on five flex, so for $44. You've got it on free shipping, which is a savings of about $22. And that's a big deal. So not only do you have a feature price, but you also have uh, free shipping, I guess a savings of almost $21 there. And we, we also have flex pay. So if you would love for us to send it to you, Call us and let us know. Do you want it in black or do you want it in white? You get everything and you even get that dual, dual layered rack which you can only get at HSN, that's exclusive. And to show you how easy this is, I'm cooking backwards here. I'm using the camera to, <laughs> to know which buttons to push. So I'm just setting this for uh, maybe about five minutes at 400 okay. with air crisp. Okay. And that is how easy it is to cook. I'm doing it backwards, like okay. to camera. Yeah. <laughs> so really it's like the, the, you know, making dinner of the future where you right. put all the ingredients in, you hit a couple buttons, you can walk away, you can watch TV, you can spend time with your kids or your husband or your, uh, your spouse and dinner's done. I like that it's, I like that you show how easy it is because if the only thing that's keeping you away is, oh gosh, I've got to learn something new. It's it, so easy. It literally walks you through it. It really does. And so here we've done eight pounds of wings. So oh these were gosh. frozen. We did them in about 20 minutes. We started with pressure cooking them to get them nice and tender and juicy and delicious. Then we air crisp them. Wow. Look at that, how crispy they are. I mean, there's so many of them in there there. And so we got them crisped on the outside, just like you would at a restaurant. Ooh. So you've got these wonderful, delicious wings. These came straight out of the freezer. It took us 20 minutes to do, including pressure cooking and and air crisping. And so think about the weekends, if you've got friends and family coming over, you know, if you're watching any of your favorite sports, you know, maybe, I know it's snowing again up yes. north, maybe you yes. wanna have a barbecue indoors, yeah. you're able to do that. And because it's air crisped instead of fried, mm -hmm. you're also saving in the fat. That's right. So it's 70% or 75%, I think, less fat than yeah. you would if you were frying it in oil. And so wow. you're able to have all those delicious indulgent things that you that you love, Yeah. but you're frying it in air instead of frying it in oil. Without 
Off the guilt, and I don't know if you caught when Rochelle said they came straight from the freezer, which means you don't have to think ahead. I, I say this because I'm talking about myself. Sometimes <laughs> I forget to take out something to be thawed. Yeah. And I get home and I have 45 minutes or an hour or whatever it is to get some, some kind of food yeah. on the dinner table and yeah. everything's frozen. Everything's what do frozen. you do? <laughs> this, you reach for your Ninja you're, because you can go from frozen and that just gives you that peace of mind as you're you know, cooking for the family. And so now we've got fries. Ooh. We're just gonna do a whole little barbecue indoors uh, tonight. So we've got four pounds of fries. Oh my Again, gosh. these came from frozen. All we did is the air crisp function. So we did use, with the wings we used, the pressure cooker and the air crisp, but you can just use it as an air fryer. Okay. So you're essentially replacing about eight appliances. I'm gonna have an avalanche of fries here as I reach over, there we go. Okay. So four pounds of fries. So, you know, if you've got kids coming, uh, you know, or you've got teenagers that are coming, you know, for the weekend to, uh, <laughs> to mm. raid your fridge, you Ooh. know, if you've got four pounds of fries in the freezer, you can have these done in maybe about 15 minutes. Super crispy, super delicious, straight from the freezer. And that's the advantage of having an eight quart because yes. you can cook a lot. You don't always have to. But when you have to, you have the capacity to. You do, absolutely. Mm -hmm. You can always make, uh, what is it? You can always make a lot in a big pot, but you can't make a lot in a little pot. Yeah. Or you can make a little in a big pot. Like <laughs> right, you can make a little in a big pot, but you can't make yes. a lot in a little pot. Exactly, exactly. And so if you're saying, wow, that's a lot for every, you don't have to, you don't have to fill it up every day, every time. But there will be those times where people come over, you're entertaining. entertaining. Yeah. Or maybe you just do what a lot of people do, is that you kind of cook a lot, and then you kind of graze on it throughout the week. Yeah, and you know what, I showed the salmon dinner earlier, that was really just a dinner for two. So you can do the 360 meals, and those recipes are also in the book, um, where you just do your grains at the bottom, and then you do your protein on the top, and then you also do um, a vegetable, you know, the last couple minutes with the air crisp. So with this one, I wanted to show you with the double rack how you can get double the capacity when you need it. Mm -hmm. So we, we've got all this wonderful cheese, I really love all this cheese. <laughs> so we did four cheeseburgers, and we did four brats. So if you did want to do something, if you're entertaining, you have mm -hmm. that capacity to do it with the uh, eight core capacity and with this uh, double rack here. So you can do, you know, an indoor barbecue on the weekend if it's Ooh. snowing or like in Florida, we've got mosquitoes yeah. that love me. So I like to cook <laughs> indoors more often than out. Smart um, lady. <laughs> the, double, the double rack here is also great for, um, you know, steaming vegetables or for dehydrating, but there's three different ways to use it. So this is one of the ways. You can also turn it upside down for steaming. You can turn it the other way around that I had for the salmon. Yeah. So I like that it gives you multiple ways to cook and multiple oh. things that you can do with it. And I think that's really the theme of this is just every part of it multitasks. Yes. And it really fits into your lifestyle of what you want to eat, how you want to cook, how you want to clean, mm -hmm. how you want your food to taste, um, what you don't want in it, which might be extra fat and extra oil and extra calories. But what you do want in it, which is the taste and the flavor. Mm -hmm. And many of us don't have time to devote to cooking for long periods of time. So we love the, the convenience of a pressure cooker. And now I, at home, I have a pressure cooker, which I'm crazy about. I have an air fryer. I wish I had had it all in one because um, it just takes up less space. And so remember, you've got a feature price. I wouldn't, and, a free sh and free shipping on this one. I would not wait on it. So this is coming together nicely. You, you remember you saw me put the cheese and the pepperoni in here? Yeah. I could let this caramelize and go for another couple minutes, or I could serve it now. I can keep it on keep warm if you're doing like a church function or if you've got, you know, uh, family coming over. I'm gonna grab this spoon real quick here. Okay. And I'm gonna show you how we pressure cooked Ooh. the pasta first. So each one of these noodles oh is infused God. with flavor and then we melted the cheese on top. And so it's all done all in one pot. I didn't have to get out multiple pots and pans. I didn't have to turn on my oven. Look at that wonderful gooey oh cheese. Oh my goodness. So if you want to, you know, cook for, uh, you know, 12 to 15 people for mm -hmm. some event that you have, you can. Oh my goodness. Or you could just do some batch cooking on the weekend for yourself and have your whole, you know, dinner ready. <laughs> That's right. For the week. You could definitely do some batch cooking as well. And I think some of you are looking and saying, oh, I would so do this. Now, remember, you're getting, along with your Ninja, you get a recipe book with 45 recipes recipes in it. And the recipe that you've got right here yes. is right there it's in the right book. It's right here in the book. Full the, color. Yeah, the, pe uh, the pepperoni pizza pasta bake. It's a tongue oh. twister. <laughs> oh my gosh. But it's also a crowd pleaser. I really love it. And, it. and they don't take a lot of time and it's the kind of food that we just eat and love. There's nothing too kind of, you know, over our heads or in there. I know you're going to love the food. If you want the recipe book that I'm holding, 
It's the big cookbook. There are 175 recipes in here. There are meal plans in here. It is that multi-cooker that we, you know, recipe book that's just gonna make it easier for you. You've got full color pictures, you've got it all. So if you want this book, you can get that one on Flex as well, $11.65. Completely up to you. Um, whichever way you want to go. You're getting the 45 recipe book included, but if you want an additional, um, because you see that this is going to be a part of your cooking lifestyle, then do it. It really becomes like your best friend in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. Once you make one recipe, you're like, what else can I make with right, it? And then you right. get really excited and you're using it on the weeknights and doing the 360 meals. You're inviting friends over and, and pressing them with your ribs. These are our ribs that we did. Oh my. And to do these ribs, I'm like, I'm loving the smell of the barbecue here. Yeah. To do these ribs normally would take you hours in a smoker or out, you know, baby sitting the grill or it would cost you a lot of money if you were going to go to a restaurant and order this we did three racks of ribs in here wow and we pressure cooked them for you know i think it was 20 minutes for three racks you okay. can do if you do one rack you can do it for less and then we air crisped them to get this nice oh. caramelization this nice barbecue bark that looks like you spent hours you know yeah. outside by you know by a smoker you know right. babysitting them they are fall off the bone fork tender um juicy and delicious they have that nice caramelization from the barbecue sauce oh this is the one where after the show everybody's waiting <laughs> outside of the studio to get their hands on these ribs for the ribs look at that they keep going and they keep going, going and going Three and racks. the reason i love the eight core capacity is i gotta tell you i had the six and a half quart and and everybody loved it and but ninja kept hearing from everybody saying we just want to be able to do more we want it bigger mm -hmm. so ninja here hears you when you when you make those comments and they, they made it bigger for that reason and i would do a single rack in the six and a half quart Mm -hmm. And my husband we, and I would be like, did you get more ribs? Like, you know, like we were fighting over who got more ribs. Yeah. Now I can do three racks so I yes. can invite friends over yeah. and we can share. And, and, and again, it's eight quarts. Mm -hmm. This is, I mean, this is the big one. Um, and, and I like that because there are some meals where you're not going to fill it up, but yeah. some like this... I mean, since since you're cooking the ribs, you yeah. may as well cook as many as will fit in. Yeah, absolutely. And so because you can do three racks, you can cook for a crowd. Um, you know, you can cook just for yourself, too, mm -hmm. if you just want to do a single rack. But I just want to show you really quickly over he head here how it's fork tender. I'm pulling it away oh from the bone yeah. with a fork. And there, there it is. Oh. I mean, it's just, it's fork tender. Look at this. I mean, think about how many hours you would have to spend, you know, doing a, uh, you know, sitting by the smoker, sitting yeah. by your grill, or how much money you would spend on three racks of ribs if you were to go to, you know, a, you know, a restaurant, your favorite That's barbecue right. restaurant. That's right. Personally, we always eat ribs at home now. My husband's mm -hmm. like, I prefer our ribs more than uh, <laughs> going out to eat. That's, <laughs> that's saying a lot. Yeah. It really is. There, this is a customer pick, and that's saying a lot, too. Um, it's a customer pick because it does make your cooking life easier, your cleanup life easier, and the, the people who get the pleasure of eating your meal are going to enjoy the juiciness, yeah. the flavor that's imparted in the food, the fact that because it's easier to cook, um, you know what? Sometimes when it's easier to do something, we do it more often. We do. Mm -hmm. And if it's easier to cook, easier to clean, I'm more likely going to make your favorite meal um, because it doesn't take as much time as it used to. Exactly, exactly. So here we just did a mac and cheese casserole. So rather than again having to, we pressure cooked the, the noodles with the cheese. So each one of those noodles is infused with flavor. Then we added the breadcrumbs and the butter and things on top and air crisped it mm -hmm. to get this nice golden brown delicious on the top. So normally you'd take, th you know, two different pots and pans. You'd have to transfer this to your oven. So we did this all in one pot. I also want to show you, this is a cheese casserole and look at how nothing is sticking to the side. It is nonstick. It is good. really easy to clean. Mm -hmm. So even when you're all done, if you're cooking for a crowd, you're going to love it because you don't really have to spend hours scrubbing pots and pans. That's right. It's all, it's, it's super easy to clean once you're done. <laughs> this, this, it's a whole new world. It is. It really is. And if you're near your computer, I would love for you to go and read some of the customer reviews, that they are rave reviews on this. But we've shown you, you know, snacks. We've shown you, um, you know, dinner. We've shown you 
you know, uh, our main our main meals, and now we've got dessert. Now we've got a peach cobbler. So oh we did these with frozen gosh. peaches in just two minutes. Then we added the topping and the butter and the almonds and brown sugar, and we made a cobbler in about seven minutes. Oh my gosh! And it's funny now that I, now that my husband knows I can do this, he, you know, we'll be after dinner. He's like, "Can we have some cobbler? Because I know it only takes five minutes, and we have the peaches frozen, like you know. But you know, you can do a cobbler for twelve yeah. in seven minutes, or you can do top cobbler for two in seven minutes. So I really love that you can take what's in your freezer. You don't have to plan out far and ahead. Yeah. And you've got a quick dessert or dinner or ribs or chicken or whatever you want to cook. That's so good. And remember, the only thing you have to do is change the lid. And you're getting both yes. the pressure cooking lid as well as that air fryer yes. lid. Yes. And we have an yeah. animation if we want to show you guys again okay. uh, how those two lids work because okay. it's really easy to use. Um, mm -hmm. Basically, you're going to use your pressure cooking lid for the pressure cooking function. You're going to use your air crisping lid for the air crisping lid, okay. uh, function. And the right buttons will light up. And so here's how it works. Okay. So here's the pressure cooking lid that's about to come on. So that's the pressure cooking lid. Once you screw that on, all of the air, or all of the pressure cooking functions will light up. This is gonna infuse your food with flavor. It's gonna infuse it with moisture. Um, it's going to cook in 70% less time. Then all you have to do is swap the top. So that's kind of showing you how you swap the top. Then it's an air fryer. Yeah. Then it's gonna surround your food with 360 degrees of hot air. It's gonna make it nice and crispy and it's gonna cook it in less time. Oh You're gonna my love gosh, it. I know you will. <laughs> Call us, let us know if you want it in black or in white. Um, Rochelle, thank you. Stay close, we've got so much more. Sarah's coming up next with electronics. Okay, how dare you guys make me so hungry before I have to present electronics for two hours. All right, well, hopefully we've whetted your appetite for some really great electronics today. My name is Sarah.